Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Simon and it is time to say goodbye to Star Wars Rebels. Uh, we're beginning the first of the three final episodes. Um, I've stayed up until it's currently 3am in the morning here in the UK. Um, in previous seasons the episodes have been released at the beginning of the day in America, which is kind of like in the afternoon in the UK, but not so much for this season, so I've had to wait up until the early hours of the morning. And uh, I'm hoping it's going to be well worth it. It's going to be really sad to see the uh, show end. But hopefully they'll give us a really good, you know, sort of uh, episode or a good story to go out on. Um, last episode really was, you know, sort of era-defining in that it changed a lot in the way that we thought about the Force, you know, with regards to um, controlling time and space and Ahsoka being, you know, brought back from the brink. Um, but yeah, I really just want to get into this. So anyway... Let's jump into this. So enough chat. Let's react. This is Base. Rex in his six, seven, Endor eight, armor. Two. I'm assuming this is. Uh... I'm assuming that was Wolf and uh, Gregor. Oh, cool! They've upgraded. They're family on the housing market now. There he is, there's Gregor. Uh, Wolf, sorry. Getting my clones mixed up. It's time we discussed the mission. Uh, of course. It's good to see Callus though. We've not seen him really a season at all. I'm curious. How are we going to split the profits? Are we stealing? Are we Come on, Hondo. liberating? I have to talk to Hera. So the finale takes place on Lothal, at least. I think we can assume that much. Ezra, I have General Sindula. The Emperor is sending Thrawn back to Lothal. Okay. It's now or never. Thrawn's coming back. Then it's never. And we didn't get that we scene with Thrawn and the Emperor. Already tried and failed. Our best what a shame. Is to lay low, reorganize, and rebuild. Hello, Arinda. Rider Azadi. Oh. This is a bold move. I do what I have to do to survive. Barely. How do they know each other? Stop me from usurping you as governor. And yet here I am, alive, to offer you something you can't resist. Oh, your head on a platter. Not mine. The I'm trying to like. All of them. You I read about how she got into power in the Thrawn book, but I can't remember the her. Captain. And I don't want to end up back in an imperial. Taking over from him, but. Or worse. <sighs> You want amnesty. Mm, it has been so far. Oh. He says Where that and they going? go. Wait. Do you hear that? Imperial chips. Hey, yeah. You should have brought an entire fleet of ships. I've got a feeling that six troop transports is not going to cut it. Whoa! Jump troopers! And those cannons! It's interesting how they never quite explained how Iron Squadron came back into the fold here. You know, it's just like everyone's just kind of coalesced together. Oh shit, it's Rook. Oh. I think, is this the first time that we've seen jump troopers? Or rocket troopers, I should say. That weren't Mandalorians. Oh, come on, Ezra. I want you to cut Rook in two. And then he will be the quarter man. Whoa! That was close. Come on, Chopper. Do your thing. <laughs> that is your thing. That is why I love Chopper. 
absolutely why I love Chopper to bits. Sabina's kicking ass right now. Come on, Ezra. Do it for Kanan. That's it, just force, force push. Ugh. Yes. Awesome. I was going to say force push the fucker, but I can't get my words out because it's 3 a.m. and my brain is frazzled. I'm getting tongue tied. More coffee is needed. Yes. Go on, Zeb. Go on, Zeb. Whoa. Okay, Zeb means business. Yeah, you better get off. But again, they are a real. There's too many. Ah, it's never been a problem in the past. They're terrible shots. Rook might be a problem, though. Uh, I think Ride is gonna. I'm beginning to regret the day I met you, Ezra Bridger. <laughs> Day's not over yet, Bizarro. Oh, I think Ryder is gonna help them at the last minute. I've seen enough. Uh oh. Is that the uh, is that the crawler that they stole from the mining guild? Uh. Oh. Drop your weapons. Fuck. This isn't part of the plan, I don't guess. Secure, Governor. And I have the boy. Was this part of the plan? I don't know. Are they just trying to lure her out onto the platform and then Hera's gonna come in and save the day? Ryder, you betrayed us. It's like I said. I'm still not convinced. We were never going to win without an army. A wise choice. I knew you'd think so. We wouldn't have been able to fool Thrawn, but you? Yep. Yeah. Well, okay. looks like we both took a gamble today. But I won. No. Um, because literally just that second. Do you want to tell her or should I? Oh, I've been waiting years for this. Getting you to come all the way out here was part of our plan. For all the good it did you. Your little rebellion ends right now. You are my prisoners. Yeah. About that. Get your lightsaber. Boop. Okay, little pig dude is having fun. I think at least two of those. I mean, Rex survives, but I think uh, Wolf and Gregor are going to die. I wouldn't be surprised if Callus died as well. Why didn't the Empire ever bring their own droids? They're very, very useful. Where is your army now, Jedi? <laughs> yes. <laughs> right there. Yes, eat him. And she's going to get captured. 
Okay, is that him dead? I didn't quite see where they threw him. Oh, nice. I think we're going to see a very similar maneuver in Solo. We saw it in the trailer. Uh oh, Gregor. Don't stand there. And they've got her. Don't let it eat me, please. <laughs> Now, what about that you? surrender. Governor to governor. Okay, episode one of Free Down, and um, yeah, it's just straight into it. Straight into the uh, <laughs> the action. Um, the assault on Low Fall has begun, and they've captured Price, and those wolves are fierce. Um, now, the biggest question for me in that episode is, did we see the death of Rook there? Um, you know, we saw him get thrown, but we don't know exactly where, and with a character like that, I'm always kind of skittish about writing them off. Um, you know, if, if he is dead, then yay. You know, for more than one reason. You know, it's not just a threat that he poses to the rebels. He also poses a threat to fraud. And anyone who knows anything about fraud in the old canon knows why. Um, and I, that's one thing I really want to come out of these episodes is fraud to survive. Um, I get the feeling that the next episode's Fraun's going to be back on Lothal, and he's just going to go crazy, and he's just going to wipe out the entire city. He's going to be like, you know what? I've lost my TIE Defender program. The people are rebelling. Let's just get rid of this place. And I think that's what he's going to do. I think he's going to try and uh, raise Lothal to the ground, which I'm not going to lie, would be interesting to see. Um, but yeah, no casualties there. I thought maybe one of the clones would die. Um, I was even at one point thinking maybe that kid from Iron Squadron might die as well. I was like, mm, maybe. Um, but yeah. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Uh, the second episode should be up soon. I don't know if it's one episode or if they've combined it into like if they've combined it into one hour long episode or if it's two separate half hour episodes. I don't know. But it'll be up soon. So, thanks for watching.